In this video, I'm going to talk about the proper slope of a drain pipe. So the picture here is actually a vent pipe. It is not a drain pipe. Just wanted to give you an idea of what you will be looking at. Sometimes a picture is worth a thousand words. Now, again, this same slope of a quarter inch per foot, quarter inch per linear foot, will apply to a vent pipe and to a drainage pipe and this would be anything three inches and less um, of a pipe so three inch two inch inch and a half pipes are going to need to slope a quarter of an inch per foot when you're running them horizontal like the uh, picture here the distance i'm going to be talking about will be from one end of the pipe to the other and again i have a drawing that you are going to see next um, but like I said I just wanted to give you guys a better picture sometimes a picture is worth a thousand words and in this case it just might be worth more than that so what we have here is a drawing of a section of a floor so you can see I have the floor joist marked and then the drainage pipe um, and of course the water will be draining in the picture from left to right um, and actually it will go down the horizontal slope and then down into the pipe which is in the wall here so again I'm, I'm just uh, I put the pictures in there to give you guys a better idea of what we're looking at and I hope you guys understand if you don't let me know and I will make another video give you guys a little more insight um, the distance is a quarter inch per foot so if you can see in the picture on the farthest end we have three inches and then we have a four foot distance in between um, the horizontal pipe and then of course it is actually lowered by an inch so the floor joist would be horizontal or level and the pipe is actually sloping so the water will drain um, you know, if the water's an eighth of an inch, I mean, if these pipes are an eighth of an inch, um, let's face it, they're still going to drain. They just won't meet your, meet your local building codes. So building code is a quarter inch per foot. Now, it can always be greater, but it can't be less. Now, again, um, there are thousands of videos on YouTube and if you are going to do anything that's going to require a building permit you will need to check with your local building department i'm just trying to give you guys a general idea of what some of the building codes call out for um, again any plumbers out there want to uh, put some uh, give me some feedback i'd love to hear it uh, as long as it's positive can't tell you how many times I get feedback from these guys like I'm ripping them apart and I think that uh, I'm a framer basically build the home the plumbers usually end up tearing into the work I've done creating more work for me and it's uh, understood why we really don't get along but come on let's uh, pull it all together like Rodney King and pretend like we're getting along so again love to hear your comments um, let me know what you think and keep watching our videos